All right, hello everyone. We are back with Glenn Velvet Reviews here, and we just got a gun safe. My brother-in-law got a gun safe, and we're gonna check it out. We're gonna see what he got. He got it for his Beretta gun, and we're gonna see how it looks and see what's up. Uh, what's the name brand of it? R, what is that? RPNB. RPNB? Yep. RPNB. Okay, so this is the first time I've ever seen it or opening it, so, I'm not, uh, um, so you're opening with me as a new person. Is this already open, you said, or I gotta? Uh, most of it. In... Oh, okay, you're right, you're right. Just a minute, open, okay. So let's open this up, let's see what we got. Okay. All right. So is this strictly made for handguns, right? You said? Uh, no, you can put anything you want in there. Anything you can uh, fit. Personal, much, right? money, gun. Okay. Oh, okay. So anything valuable that, okay. that fits. All right, so at first this comes the accessories for the RPNB. That comes up over here first. Um, I'm not sure what's in here. We'll open it up real quick and just take a gander. It's the keys. These are the keys. They look like they are laser cut keys on the center. So that's what they are. So these are, it comes with two keys. Same. That's pretty cool. So those are the keys that are in there. Just, there use it. So here it's all wrapped up. Let's get this wrapping out. Okay, so we got to Here's the instruction manual. It's called a pistol safe, is what they call it. A pistol right. safe. So they do promote it as a pistol as safe. As a pistol safe. So they do promote it as that. That's the uh, instruction manual and just tells you about it. Comes with um, two backup keys, owner manual, hardware mounting kit if you want to mount it to the wall or mount it inside somewhere, I guess. And the battery tray, I guess. Battery compartment. So it tells you everything in here. Programming tips, how to program it. And that's it. If you have any questions, any comments, post them down below. Um, so let's open this, let's pull this baby out. So we're gonna pull this out. Okay. Then we're gonna get rid of the box so this is not in the way. Okay. So let's get rid of that box. So this is how it goes like this. And this is kind of what it looks like. So with the foam on each side, we're gonna pull this out. Okay, so we got that out. It says, warning, plastic bags are dangerous for kids, so make sure you don't let your kids go playing with a plastic bag. That doesn't make sense. Okay, so we got it pulled out. That's what it looks like, just like that. Here's the number pad. They're very big numbers, so it's a four numeric pad. Keypad, as you can see. Um, please press lid firmly to lock. Never lock keys in safe, only install new batteries. So that's kind of what it says. Um, I don't know how to open this yet. Maybe it's, usually it's like a zero, zero, zero combination. What's that? Oh, here's where the key goes if you're gonna open it. Let's try that out. So here's the key. That's where the key goes. There's a little rubber covering over it, as you can see right here. So that's what it is right there, little keyhole. So we're gonna open that up and see what it looks like because I'm not sure about the programming yet. Um, this is my first time opening it, so you're the first, you know, seeing it first. So here we go, we're gonna stick the key in there. Bam, opens up just like that. So that's pretty cool. So you saw how that opened, it goes like that, it's spring-loaded, opens up just like that with the key. Um, obviously, I guess when you have it open, you can be able to set your, uh, uh, number pad or whatever you want as your four digit code or I don't, is it four digits six digit or is it any I think what? it's six digits six digits okay I could be wrong. all right so it comes with the mounting hardware right here if you're going to mount it into a wall or mount it in, into the uh, floor whatever you pick there's an extra soft pad in here so this way your gun doesn't get scratched or whatever your valuables that you're going to be putting in here does not get scratched you're going to want to keep the silica gel um, I would probably want to keep this and keep this inside with your gun and everything because it helps um, with moisture and everything like that until this is not any good then it doesn't matter. But if you don't get water in there then it should last for a very long time. Uh, then the battery compartment comes off. It's on the inside right here. It's on the inside right here. Like that. So it's on the inside right here. This cover comes off right here. And then it looks like it's four AA batteries. <clears throat> so you're gonna wanna change those out on the regular and not have it die on you when you do need it because that doesn't make sense. Then what's the point of buying this kind of safe? 
So you are gonna make sure that you're gonna to wanna to change them out probably once a year uh, to fresh batteries to make sure that it's always gonna be working for you when you do need it most. So that's it for the, pretty much for the review of the, uh, the pistol safe that we have here. Like I said, it comes with this nice soft pad you can put inside here after you put the batteries in. And then your pistol's gonna sit right in there. And that's it. Uh, I'm not sure about programming. We're gonna go over that in another video because I'm not sure even how to do that yet. Um, and then we'll check that out in the next time. But for right now, um, that's just a review on the unboxing of it, what it looks like, how it opens up, so you guys can see. It does feel pretty sturdy. It feels like a nice hinge, but it's also made for speed at the same time. And this is, it's a pistol, um, what's it called? It's a pistol, um, you know, safe. So it's made to be, you know, you have your gun in there and be able to open it up quickly and be able to grab your gun just in case of an emergency. Like, that's the point of it, so. <clears throat> And that's it. So thank you for watching Glenn Velvet Reviews. I am out. Uh, if you have any questions, any comments, always post them down below. I would love to know. Um, also, subscribe to my channel and join me on my review adventures uh, of everything else that I like to do. So that's it. Everybody have a good one. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.